Hello there. This is a review for my Leatherotics Black Leather Underbust. Here's the front, the side, the back, and the other side. This corset can be found at the Leatherotics website, but I bought this one from their eBay store uh, because they were out on their website, but it's um, a comparable price. They vary a little bit on eBay, but uh, the website price is $71.51, and it is the same style corset as the pink and white one I reviewed right here, but I actually ordered a size smaller, so this one was 22 inches and this one is 20 inches. I can close this one all the way, and this one I cannot. It's... Um, the center front is nine and a quarter inches. The smallest part on the side is seven and a half inches, and the center back is nine inches. It is a six panel pattern. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there are two hip gores on each side, these little ones right here. This style corset is very curvy, as you could see and also very comfortable. I find this extremely comfortable, especially since I have a shorter torso and it doesn't even go over my iliac crest bones, which stick out pretty far. And it's also considered to be either a waspy or a cincher style uh, just because of its small stature. And it feels like there's two layers in here. The outer layer is their butter soft black leather. And the inner layer is a black twill, cotton twill. And it's also very soft. I really like the feel of this. The waist tape is a ribbon. It is visible. And it is just in the middle four panels. Like if you look at this side. It doesn't go all the way to the end, it doesn't go all the way in there. Um, but it still seems to do its job. The busk. It's flexible, yet pretty darn sturdy. And it is a four pin busk, half an inch wide. There is no modesty placket, but it does have a busk cover on both sides. Um, when you wear it, you can actually see, still see the bust because it, um, just by the cinching effect, it just kind of flaps open a little bit. But, I mean, I don't care if there's a bust cover or not. It is a single boned corset. And there are 14 total bones. The website says it has 16. I think they count the bust, but I mean, that's not a bone, I guess. Anyway, there's 10 spiral seals total, 4 flat, and the bones are in internal twill tape casings here. With the outside, they look like casings, but it's more of a welt seam, so the seams were put together, I mean like sewn together at the panels, and then folded on the outside, tucked under, and then sewn down again. There are 22 total grommets on this corset. Um, there's no splits. I've heard people complain about Latherotics corsets having problems with their grommets. They have been said to have ripped out of their corsets. And so far I have three Latherotics corsets and I have not had that problem at all. But I'm sure it is possible. They do have quite a small rim and small washer on the inside as well. So, yeah, it's possible, but if it happens, um, tell the website and maybe they will replace it. The modesty panel is five and a half inches wide and it's not leather on the other side, it's the black cotton tool on both sides, still very soft. And oh, on this corset, there's actually no modesty panel in the back. The binding 
is a black flat um, like a nylon cord with the tiniest bit of stretch but it does hold very well like when you cinch up it doesn't uncinch itself so that's very nice the ribbon or the um, binding is a ribbon and it's sewn so the inside was sewn on first and folded over and the outside is like the edge. I wish they kind of did it the opposite. It would look a little bit neater. Um, I kind of wish it was in leather like this one for the binding but um, you couldn't really tell on their website what the binding was. Um, so yeah, but it's just it is what it is. And there's also garter tabs too on each side. And what's nice about this one, I mean, I don't wear garter tabs, or I mean I don't use them, but on this corset, the garter tabs were hanging out, um, so you could see them on uh, the outside when you were wearing them because they sewed them in downwards way here. And on these, they're sewn up. So when you wear it, it's not sticking out of the bottom, which is awesome. The, um, oh, my recommendations with this corset. If you are prone to having a tummy pooch when you wear a corset, I would not recommend this style for you. It is so short on the body that it just squishes stuff out and when you sit down it kind of squishes even more and that's going to happen obviously I'm very slender and I even get a little pooch with this so I wouldn't recommend it for if you don't want that um, I would not recommend this for waist training on their website it says you can train in this well it probably won't hold up just saying um, and the website also doesn't have accurate measurements in the description, but other than that, I really like this corset. I wear it all the time, so if you have any questions or comments, let me know below and I will answer them for you. Thanks for watching.